of you. He's an imposter of fake. All right. I didn't plan this video. I did not script any of this out. I'm just kind of I'm just going to be rambling. But the the summer camp shelter here, uh, while it looks pretty good, like from a from an initial visual standpoint, like I, I bought this, I loaded in, I got excited. But once I started trying to fucking build shit in it, I it, it's, it's just so the summer camping tab, uh, I, I saw this shelter get kind of like leaked uh, before the season dropped and I was so excited. Because I wanted a, you know, a nice good outdoorsy area that wasn't a fucking barren wasteland. Why would I want to build there? Bethesda is, okay, whatever. But I, I see the greenery, I see the trees, there's a lake, there's elevation. And I'm getting excited, I can't wait. It comes out, it drops with the seas, and I buy it immediately, okay? And not only that, but I get ground cover. I gotta have my ground cover, I get my trees. I even get this fucking thing, I don't know. I just get whatever. Because I want to be able to make this nice little outdoor space, okay? But there are some... There's like two problems. There's like two problems with this place that make it fucking impossible to build in. Now, I don't know how many atoms in the atomic shop that I spent to, to, to get this place and some of these items, but I can't believe like how frustrating it is to build here because don't get me wrong the normal fallout 76 building process is frustrating almost by design there's way too many limitations you can't even put shit on shelves normally like who bethesda no one cares if shit's clipping into each other like it doesn't matter it's not a real problem let us build how we want to build but we got to have these completely unnecessary restrictions but oh but in the shelters, they get lifted a little bit. It's easier. You can, uh, I can make this float. Okay. I can make this float, but for some reason I can't, I can't put this right here. Why? What? I can't put this right here. I can't make an actual dock with the dock piece. I had it kind of like halfway into the ground over here at the start, but it looked awful. I, I wanted to build this like right next to these steps, like right, right here. Like that would look good. Why can't I do that? When I try to place it, it's only green when it's either like underwater or too high. Like, let's see this. So I can place that right there, but then it doesn't let me snap anything to it. Like my snapping's on. Can I snap on this side? Yeah, I can snap on this side, but I can't I can't snap in this direction. Look at that. Like it goes on, but it's red. Why is it red right here? Like this this is only this is only part 1, but it's still so frustrating that I can't put something in the water. I think the boat works. Can I get the boat maybe just above the water? Okay, yeah, so the boat works fine, but I can't build a dock out into the lake for some reason. What's the point of having this? Can I do it with maybe a normal floor? Okay, the, the, the direction is still off, but... Oh, look at that! That's almost right on! I could probably get that lined up perfectly, but I can't use the, the summer, like, dock option to make a nice little aesthetic dock. I don't, I don't want this to be my dock. This, I want that, like, actual dock prop to just work properly but it's so aggravating to try and get it lined up. This is maybe the best I can get it, but I still can't put it as close as I want it. And it's still like, what? what is this gap? This doesn't need to be here. Why can't I just place this normally? And it's like this around the entire space. Like this, this is like perfect. Why is it red? What is it intersecting with? There's no, that is the, I hate seeing that pop up. There's nothing else here when this is a really Oh, damn, I didn't even realize how fucking shallow this lake is for no reason. But <laughs> I can only place them either underwater or too high. Maybe if I... Can I do this? And then can I... Can I snap this? Uh... No? Fuck off, dude. Okay, so that's, that's number one. And that is arguably a smaller problem because it's only with this dock piece as far as I can tell. I mean, I don't have any other dock pieces to test out. I mean, this is a huge disappointment on its own because this is, this is going to be the centerpiece of the whatever, right? But here's something that's way worse. So I was trying to put this, uh, this tree up here, right? This awful watch boat. And this, is a, this, is a, this prop sucks, by the way. Do not get this prop. It's a you know, really tiny little rickety way up no window like what the fuck is the point of this but anyways i'm trying to put this up here because i wanted to put some trees around it i can't <laughs> i actually can't it immediately just teleports 
underground. Can I actually place this down there? Yes, yeah, so I can place this down there and practically lose it in the fucking negative zone. But I can't just sink this into the ground a little bit. Like, I can, I can technically place it up here, but what is this? It, it looks like the leg of some kind of spider monster. Why can't I put the tree roots in the ground? Okay, it works over here. But I, I, you can't put stuff up here. You, like the, the big props don't work. I don't know if the little ones do. No, it happens with these two. It happens with small stuff and big stuff. It just, <laughs> dude, what is this? This looks like a, I'm making the, the, the outside shower into a fucking shitter. This looks like the world's most uncomfortable outside toilet. It's got a little step and everything. That's crazy. <laughs> I got a fucking pot with it. Uh, hot tub? No. No hot tub. No roundup. What about, what about, like, actual small? Like, can I put a table up here? No. Like, what is this? How is it coded to work like this? Why does this happen? Like, okay, it works right here and it works on the rocks, but if we get over here, we got a fucking table in the ground. Okay, we buried the table for no reason. But that's not the only place that happens at. Now, it's bad enough that we can't use the elevation that comes with this shelter but let's take the let's take my candle house right here let's say I want to put this candle house on top of here oh no I fucking can't for no like what is the reasoning how does this work see initially this happened at the start of the season and I was like oh okay you know it's on release maybe it's just a little buggy but how have they not fixed this yet? We're weeks into Skyline Valley in this shelter existing. There's no way that it's only happening to me. Like, there's no way that nobody else has complained about this. Like, I don't know if I'm recording this video to, to like, post it publicly or just send it to Bethesda's support to ask why this is happening. But for some reason, you can't use... I mean, what what is that? Like, there are only so many interesting spots on this place. We have our... We've got our middle right here. Uh, I guess I put some some foundations here and forgot about those. We got this middle. We got the lake. We got right here, up there, and then I guess over here. So uh, everything around this little circle piece works normal enough. Well, I don't, I don't know why I can't place it down right there. Like what? What is the point of doing shelters if the restrictions aren't actually lesser? The only difference between regular camp building and shelters is that I can make shit float for no reason. Like, why would I want to do this? Why can't I do this? Dude. Okay. Uh, over here? It happens over here, too! You can't even put, like, a house prop down on... What? That has to be... If it's only around this circle that you can actually put shit into the ground, and I guess maybe the front of the camp. What what is that? Like I can use twenty-five percent of this entire shelter. I'm just genuinely like I'm I'm in I'm in awe. I'm in awe at how how little I can actually make this thing function. I could put this I mean that's kinda cool. Mm, not really. But at least I can put stuff in the middle right here. Not not everything. I have to spin this thing around. Like, why Why does this not work? I don't fucking know. I paid too goddamn much for this shelter. I can't put the... Why? Why, dude? I can't even put stuff around the circle without, like, finagling it into place. Uh, we, we're introducing shelters and we're lifting some of the building restrictions. So you can put you can put shit in the air. Make a make a fucking platoon of flying mobile home trailers. Oh, we're in a shelter, but you can still only put down two of them for some fucking reason. Why? Oh, did you did you buy this shelter? Did you pay like fucking twenty bucks to get a shelter? Oh, sorry, your your fucking mobile home is going underground. <laughs> Dude, I don't want this. I don't want this shit, man. Okay, so the mobile home is fucked. What about the... The makeshift Mega Man? Okay, it works right here. So it works in this little patch of grass, but if you move it out to the side... And this is so odd, because this is like a huge prop, right? Like, this is pretty big. But it's still only the, the top. It's like it's placing this stuff on the actual invisible floor underneath everything. So maybe like this, these elevated terrain isn't really counted, but 
And maybe that's why it works like kind of on the rocks. Well, I guess not really. Uh, I don't know. This is so frustrating, dude. Because I literally waited and thought, oh, they'll fix this. I guess they haven't. So we know the roundups don't work. This doesn't work. Like, I'm just genuinely curious. How is it... And it's like it's consistent between all of these. It's not even placing it on the, the bottom of the floor. It's just acting like... It's acting like the top of every prop. Like, the top of this bottle cap is the floor. Why is it doing that? It does it... Let me let me scan with the bottle cap. Where can I place this? It does it through, through this entire section. It does it on this grass. Kind of on these rocks. Immediately right here around the lake, I guess that's fine. But up here it does it. Over here it does it. Up here it does it. <laughs> this is ludicrous. I can place this right here, but not over here. Oh, I can place something next to the steps, but not to the place the steps are going to. This is like, this is genuinely impossible to build in. And it's been weeks. The tower, like I, I would love to have, you know, a firewatch tower up here. That might look pretty cool. Even though uh, with these, with these big ass trees, you kind of realize how downscaled the tower is, which sucks, but I guess we'll suspend our disbelief. You're not watching for any fires with this fucking thing. You can't even see over the tree line. Just give us actual buildings. Oh my god. Okay, what about um, the den doesn't work? Okay, see, look. I'm gonna go look at something really quick. Let's just go look at something in the atomic shop. Lunchbox. Okay. So let's go over to the summer camp shelter. Let's look at how they built it. See this? This makes me mad. That is the dock piece that I'm trying to use and it doesn't even fit properly like on the preview image with these tires in front of it. I don't know how they even managed to get it right there. But you're telling me you're not going to fix this problem to the point where even in the promotional images it's still fucked up? I, what if I don't have these tires? What am I supposed to put right here, man? And then look at that shit up there. You can't do that. In these promo images, you actively cannot put any of that up there in the real game. How was that when they were taking their promo images for the summer camp shelter, okay? How does that work? I'm touching my screen with my finger trying to point it out like you can see it. But how did they do that? How did, how did in the process of putting this on live, did this bug happen? Because you cannot build that right now. As far as I can tell, this is literally impossible. So sometime between like finishing the camp up and taking the promo images and then we put it to the live game and then it's broken. How does that happen? And this also makes me mad. I'm not going to get out of the shelter because I don't feel like loading back into the main game. Oh, but it's right here too. I can just go. I can just go to it. I can just go show it. This is something that I, I really despise about Bethesda. This is the prop that you use to get into this shelter. You put this at your camp and you can press E on it to teleport you here. But oh, it's got the funny skeleton in it. What if I don't want a skeleton in my camp? You're telling me that I can't just have the bus? Why would why would my vault dweller look at me? I look like a reasonable person. I look like a reasonable and normal human being. Hey, let me hold on. Oh, here, look, 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 now, now, I look like a normal person. I'm cleaned up, I've fitted up my fucking vault suit, I'm wearing a, a cow and a jetpack. Why in my camp, in my place of residence that I built in the wilds, am I gonna leave a fucking skeleton sitting around? You're telling me that, what, you, you push the skeleton in the driver's seat for the funny haha, -ha, but there's not a version without it? Why is this the default? Why would this fucking like funny theme park haha -ha, apocalypse skeleton be the default? Why is this not just a different version of the same prop? This this little thing makes me so upset because it speaks to how Bethesda just does not understand what we want. Look at my look at my icon down here. I'm the settler giving a thumbs up like I'm trying to build. I'm trying to rebuild Appalachia, but ooh, I'm gonna leave the funny fucking skeleton in my apparently working vehicle. Like how does that work? Every time I want to drive to the summer camp, am I getting in this thing and removing the fucking skeleton? Do I gotta throw him in the back? And then when I get here, am I putting him back in the driver's seat that I was just in? This doesn't make sense. And it doesn't always need to make sense. But it's still, like, I'd why? 
and then we get here to the actual summer camp and the fucking wheels on the truck are like this isn't a big deal but it, it's like it was done on purpose the skeleton was obviously put there on purpose it was on purpose that we didn't get a version without it but it was also on purpose that they saw the fucking truck itself clipping into the ground and just left it is this is this as much of a big deal as like 75 percent of the camp not being functional maybe not but it's still annoying like you put this here how did you not see it fix it put put the put the fucking wheels above the ground instead of letting the shit sink into the dirt can you can we remove the fucking skeleton from my place of living please because that's something that i would do that's something in real life that i would do if i had a skeleton in my fucking house i would get rid of it that's something my vault dweller would do. I'm out here trying to rebuild America, but I'm going to leave this fucking skeleton in my working vehicle. I don't understand. Fucking theme park. Stop it. Just give us clean shit. Jesus. Ugh. Okay, I think that's it. Actually, let me look. Let me see if there's anything else in the preview images that fucking makes me angry, because this is so disappointing. Okay, see this? I can't do this. I literally cannot do this. <laughs> and this one's actually, this one's really funny to me because they put like a, they put some random ass bullshit in the middle of the place because this is the only place that you can reliably put stuff down in. This, with all this empty fucking unusable area, this is a more accurate representation of what you're buying than all of this. This is impossible. It's literally impossible. I do not think you can make this. You can't put this shit up there. You just can't. And I don't know if this area is too far away from the shoreline to be usable. It's not a functional fucking camp. And it's been weeks into this. And this... Like, yeah, I'm, I'm getting a little heated over a video game. But I spent money on this. Like, I like playing this game and building shit. Camp building is what sold me on Fallout 76. And we get this big fucking map update. Ooh, playable ghouls in like a fucking year. Okay, who cares? Tell me when I can do it. And you, you sell me this shit, and I can't use, like, a good, maybe 70%, maybe 75% is too much, but 70% of this fucking camp is unusable. The elevation is unusable. And in the preview images, they're showing me shit that is literally impossible because I can't put anything up here. What about the, what about the counselor tent, right? The pioneer scouts, that's the theme of this season. Can I put a tent up here? Ooh. Ooh. Yes, but only if you're a fucking mole, man. Am I building for the mole miners? I can I can I does this camp come with a special ability to fucking dig underground? Dude, what the fuck is this? So on on top of like the the shelters already being like not really that it, it's it's not as much advised freedom to build in as they'd want you to believe. Not only that, but we're still having the arbitrary item limits. Like, we shouldn't only be able to build two of these in the first place. It's a fucking tent. You're telling me I can't have more than two tents in my place of living? What if I want more? But but that also goes to the shelters, this outside shelter. The limit extends to the fucking campground I can only have two tents in? Are you kidding me, dude? Why can't I just, why can't I build this? We're lifting the, the building restrictions in the shelters, except we're making them worse somehow. I don't understand. I, I, I want to come over here and I want to put my fucking Firewatch Tower down and it's it's built for mole men. I don't have anything else to really say about this. I just don't understand the thought process. Because we got all the way through the promotional image stage where the docks are still not functioning. You're showing me shit that I literally cannot build in the shelter, and I and I paid my atoms. I paid my twos. Dude, I gotta... The monthly atoms, I, I put down money for this. Like, look at this. Look at this. This is a great prop. Look at how, like, clean this is. Everything's put up nice. In an apocalypse, this looks good. I would build something like this to keep my shit in. But, but why is there a skeleton in my bus? Why can't I? And, until they fix this, just don't buy the bundle. If you've already bought the bundle, sucks. I'm in the same boat. All right, bye.